I'm not asking you. Just don't you reach, reach the car, man. You can't have your pocket. Hands out your pocket. Can't have your pocket. Breaking news tonight in the case of Ahmad Arbery. The unarmed African American man was shot and killed in February while out for a jog in his Georgian neighborhood. A father and son have already been charged in his death, but tonight police say they have also arrested the man who recorded video of the killing. Investigators say they are charging William Bryan with murder and false imprisonment. Here's CBS's Manuel Borges. William Bryan recorded the February 23rd video showing Gregory and Travis McMichael in the final confrontation with Ahmaud Arbery after they chased him believing he was a burglar. Bryan has long said he had nothing to do with the incident. Need to be cleared of this because I had nothing to do with it. Arbery's family says he was out for a jog when the shooting occurred. He was seen on camera entering an open construction site before the confrontation. The Arbery's family attorney has pressed for Brian's arrest, calling him a co-conspirator. Tonight, Brian is behind bars awaiting a court appearance. Manuel Bajorquez, CBS News. This is Awkward Occurrence or Awkward Entertainment. So... Ronnie, 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 the man who filmed Amar Arbery shooting has been charged with murder. Charged with murder. He didn't even do no shooting. A third person has been charged with the murder in Amar Arbery case. The Georgia Bureau of Investigations on Thursday said it arrested William Roddy Bryan Jr., 50 years old, on charges of felony murder and a criminal attempt to commit false imprisonment. Well, let's continue on to what it says. He took the cell phone footage on February 23rd. That's when the two son and um, dad was arrested May 7th. That is a mob who will be booked into Glen County Jail. On an initial report noted Brian allegedly or tried successfully to block Arby who was jogging. So, Mr. Ronnie here took his car and tried to block Aubrey from running. I guess that's when the father and the son pulled the head and um, caught up with Aubrey. Okay, 28-second video. Let's continue. He stood outside the white pickup truck armed with a shotgun. That's Gregory McMichael, 64. The dad stood in the flatbed with a 357. So, um, we've seen the video. So, the family is relieved. So, his involvement was obvious. It probably was obvious. Like, you at the same spot at the same time when they're chasing Amar Aubrey. That's kind of obvious. Like, maybe they found out they know each other. Mr. Ronnie and these two people. So without the video, there'd be no case. So let's see where this goes. Let's see where this goes. But Mr. Ronnie is in jail.